More than 25% of women and 1 in 10 men in the U.S. are victims of domestic violence. That is from the CDC. And experts say stress during the holidays tends to make abusive relationships even worse. One local business is looking to help survivors this holiday season. And Tatiana Cash talked with them about the help that's needed. Tatiana. Melissa, that's right. So Ella Flora, this business here in Rossford, it's a weddings and floral boutique. They are collecting goods uh, for Bethany House. Now, Bethany House is one of the only uh, long term shelters for domestic violence victims and their children. Now, while we're talking about this on Thanksgiving, when I spoke with both the owner of this establishment and Bethany House's executive director, they say you've got to talk about it because abuse doesn't take a holiday. Mostly dealing Brigitte Berg specializes in the things which bring smiles to everybody. Her Rossford wedding and floral design boutique is all about happier times, but she knows life isn't always rosy. I think it is important to acknowledge, you know, the, the darker side of life and to, you know, since I am dealing with an area of my career that is a little bit more light and fluffy, you know, so to speak, um, I do want to do something, you know, tangentially good for, you know, a portion of the community that's not having happy days whatsoever. For the second year in a row, Burks is collecting items for Bethany House. And executive director Deidre Lashley is proud of local businesses wanting to help, especially during the holidays. She says the stress of the holidays, family and financial expectations can become a trigger. It's also a very dangerous time to reach out for help. And so it allows us to be able to continue to serve the survivors and the children that we have in shelter every single day. In any given year, Bethany House cares for about 30 families who are allowed to stay at the shelter up to a year and a half. When victims do leave, it's a very dangerous situation. They're 75 times more likely to be killed. So all of those reasons, it, it's a very scary um, decision to make. Lashley says victims looking for a way out should always know they have options. But she understands how hard it can be because of a lack of finances or support, but adds many do leave. And Burks urges the community to help out, especially when it counts. The Bethany House does such, you know, vital, important work in Northwest Ohio. Um, so they were really one of the, they were the only people that I thought to reach out to um, when I knew that I wanted to do something around Christmas time. All right, so again, here at Ella Floor, this is in Rossford. They are taking donations from now all the way until December 23rd, and it's everything from monetary to hygiene to business items. Go ahead and check out their website as well as they have a full list on the front door. Uh, when you do donate, you can actually get 10% off of your purchase of free flower, and it's going to be an in-store purchase that you get it. So live here in Rossford, Tatiana Cash, WTOL 11.